On this episode of Scott vs. Box, I open up the Inspector McClue Death by Chocolate Dinner Mystery Game. Do you have friends that want to play a dinner mystery game? You won't after you play! Scott vs. Box. Box! This is Inspector McClue Death by Chocolate, a classic detective murder mystery dinner party game DVD video thing. Wow. Don't, when you see this, this chocolate nipple that's busted open and bleeding, don't you want to buy this game too? Well, if that didn't sell you, it includes a special cameo appearance by Michael Winner, who, to be fair, kids in high school called him a loser, but when you look at it, he's really a winner. Hey everybody, do you know who that is? Me neither. A game for six to eight players ages teen and upwards. That's a really weird way of phrasing it. Ages teen and upwards. Ah, oh, made by Specialty Board Games Incorporated, one of my favorites. They have so many interesting games. Let's see what's on the back. Enjoy a little murder with your dinner? Uh, no, no, I'd, I'd prefer to just enjoy my lamb chops and uh, not have any murder during my dinner. Thank you very much. Oh, you're gonna insist that I have murder with my dinner? Great, there goes my enjoyment of lamb chops. So we've got the party planner with game rules, recipes, music, and decorating tips. Ooh, decorating tips. Character booklets, including their roles, background information, and a few tasty secrets. Ooh, tasty secrets. Place cards for each character. I don't want that. I don't care for it, I'm not gonna use them. Party invitations and envelopes for each character. Hooray! DVD with an instruction, scene setter, summary of events, clues, and solution to the crime. Well, I guess I'm not going to figure it out myself. Game does it for me. Everyone's a suspect when murder is on the menu. Well, that makes sense. And frankly, why are you even eating there? Did you check Yelp? Because I think Yelp said not to eat there. Oh, we look at the guests. And here's... Chocolat Betrand? Oh, I get it. Because it's a food. And then Maria von Schnapps? Oh, I get it. It's like a drink. Mike Bison? Yeah, it's like an animal that you eat. Dr. Doris Johnson? Oh, I get it. Because she likes wieners. Oh, man! Let's get inside of this and start killing all these people that uh, are involved in this game. Death, death, murder, death, murder, and death, death, death. Oh, all right. Why would you suspect me of murder with this knife? <laughs> now to open it up. Oh, man. I can't wait to kill Michael Winner. Uh, right. Oh, look, we got a thing inside. Manufactured and distributed in North America by this... Oh, it's Canada. Oh, it's a Canada game. Look at that, everybody. That ain't America. Oh, boy, there's so much stuff in here. So much stuff. Let's pull it all out. What is this thing? Oh, I get it. This is where you murder them, so then you get the blood samples. Okay, everybody, when you buy the game, make sure you murder the person on this thing so you get the blood on there, and then you can run it in the lab. Okay, let's see what else we got here. Let's open this up. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Bam! Open all that junk up right there. Let's see what we got here. Ooh, look! It's the party planner. These look like menus that are left on your on your doorstep for Thai places that you never want to eat at. Ah, oh, let's look at here. The invitations and costume suggestions. Boy, this game really puts a lot of pressure on you to really get involved in this garbage. Uh, try to send your invitations out early. Encourage your guests to enter into the spirit of the evening by dressing in appropriate costumes, as suggested in the invitations. They can choose to arrive elaborately dressed or be simple, you know, like a flannel and some jeans, and just bring along a single prop, you know, like a candle or a spoon. Oh, wow, so much fun. There the characters are again. Oh, did you know Dr. Doris Johnson is an eccentric amateur archaeologist? Wow. I would imagine it's really hard to be eccentric 
and also an amateur archaeologist. How can you live the eccentric lifestyle while being just a crappy archaeologist? Hmm. I don't know. <gasps> Dr. Sigmund Fraud. Oh, this game's hilarious. The controversial Vietnamese psychologist. I don't know what that word is. I assume it's Vietnamese because that's what I read. And that makes this funnier because it's not funny. And then Maria von Schnapps is a young but important figure in the Swiss chocolate industry. Extra guest. You don't need him. So if you have that friend that you don't want to invite along with little fits, don't bring him over. They're just going to ruin everything by farting. Oh, wow. There's so much stuff involved. So many rules. So, oh, and they tell you food suggestions. Quail egg salad. That sounds disgusting. No one wants to eat that. Other than playing this game that ruins their time, no one wants a quail egg salad. Roasted boned leg of lamb. Yes, please. I'll have six. And then spring vegetables in a cream and herb sauce and chocolate mort? What? That sounds like your Jewish uncle who's also black. Hey, everybody, it's Chocolate Mort. Damn, I love dreidels. All right, and then, oh, these are exhibit A's. These are more things. This game comes with a lot of stuff. Oh, these are the invitations. Dear Mr. Bonka. Uh, or no, these aren't the invitations. I don't know what these are. This is, uh, oh, it's, oh, it's evidence in the exhibits. I get it. It's like all these clues they give to people. So if somebody comes over and plays this game once, they're not going to want to play again, that's for certain. Oh, these are the invitations. Oh, so here, you get all these. You get so many of these. Ugh. Oh, look at this. You actually send these to people, and they have to tell you, no thank you, that I don't like... Look at this! Look at the size of this! Oh, you fold it. All right. Okay, everybody. It's all right. I see. You can fold it put it in the envelope. Man, nobody wants to... This is way too much pressure on a game. You can just play Pictionary and be happy. Oh, and then here are name tags, I guess. Oh, so much stuff. Well, here you go. And the DVD, which has got Mr. Winner in it. So there's all this stuff right here. Or you could play Stratego with your friends and end the whole thing in 20 minutes and then go on with your lives. Subscribe to my channel so that way you never miss an amazing Scott vs. Box video. Follow me on Twitter at Scott vs. Box. And send me stuff that you want to see me unbox on the show to this address over here. Oh boy, I have so much work to do unboxing things and dating women.